Hello there, you are welcome to my YouTube channel, Mr. Willie Masters. If you are looking to learn new things about mathematics, you can simply subscribe to this channel and you can be rest assured that I will keep updating this channel with new videos every week. Now, kindly subscribe to this channel, click on the like button, and you can also share with your friend. Today, we'll be looking at percentage. No, so percentage is a, just a fraction with 100 as a denominator. A percentage is a fraction with 100 as a denominator and one thing you need to know about percentage is that it comes with a sign known as percent if you don't know the meaning of percent this is a 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 percent as you can see on the board we have some examples that we are going to solve together now the first one is two percent you know i explained earlier that a percentage is a fraction with 100 as a denominator now two percent will be what that will be two over 100 since a percentage is a fraction with 100 as a denominator 2% of it 2 over 100 now let's move to example 2 so now if you look at the example 2 we have it 40% what does 40% 40 what does it stand for it simply means 40 over 100 40 over 100 now let's move on to the third example we have it 11% 11% means 11 over 100 100 11 over 100 and the last example that we have on the body is 19 percent what does 90 percent stand for it simply stands for 19 over 100 now let's dive in deeper into our lesson today we want to look at how to change fraction into percentage that is how to convert our fraction into percentage there's only one step before you want to convert your fraction into a percentage you need to multiply that same fraction with 100 then you break it down you have your percentage now watch me do it the first example that i have here is 8 over 20. now i want to change this 8 over 20 into percentage all i need to do is to multiply with 100. look at it now you have 8 over 20. the next step is multiply with 100 that is 100 over 1. what what's the next thing the next thing is break it down zero we can do zero the next thing two year one 2 in 10, that's 5. 2 in 10 is what? 5. Now, what is 8 times 5? 8 times 5 is 40. 8 times 5 is 40. Do not forget that I said earlier that a percentage comes with a special sign known as percent. Now, you need to include the sign then so it will indicate that this number has been converted to a percentage that is 40 percent. This is the percent now, 40 percent. Now, let's move to the Question 2, 1 over 4. 1 over 4 wants to convert it to percentage. Don't forget that you just need a step. Just a step that you're going to follow. That 1 over 4, you're going to multiply with 100. That is 1 over 4 times 100. Times 100 over 1. Then you break it down. 2 can go in 4 2 times. And 2 will go in 100 50 times. 2 can still go in 2. That is 1. And how many 2 can we see in 50? That is 25. The answer is 25%. So 1 by 4 as a fraction is the same thing as 25%. You can see that I have included my percent at the back of the 25. Now, the last question for today's class, we are having 2 over 5. To do that, you just multiply. Once you convert 2 over 5 into percentage, how do we do that? Just a step. Multiply with 100. After multiplying with 100, you break it down. Now, let's do it together. That is 2 over 5 times 100 over 1 the next thing is you break it down now 5 will go in 5 5 and how many 5 can you see in 10 that will be 2 5 in 0 that's 0 then you multiply together as 2 times 20 2 times 20 is what that's 40 percent that's 40 percent now i hope you have really gained a lot in this class don't forget to subscribe to my channel share click on the like button and can be rest assured that you will get a lot of videos from this channel. Thank you.